Hey, good morning. It's Owen Bigland. This is the Inside Edge video blog. It's summer 2014. It's been a good summer so far. Uh, quite active. We're uh, right up to what our 10-year average is for, uh, for market activity right now. Better than it was last summer and much better than it was in 2012. So it's been a, an active summer. So I'm getting a call pretty much every week uh, from uh, a potential client wanting me to uh, come out, have a look at their home. They want to sell it, want me to list it. Now I'd say 50% of the people that call me, um, they've already hired me for the job. I've either been referred from another client uh, or uh, they've seen my signs in the neighborhood or my postcards they've been getting over the years. They know I'm the guy for the job. The other 50% of the time though, I'm in competition. Um, uh, they want to interview a couple of realtors and, and decide who they think is going to do the best job for them, which is a smart way to go. Um, the advice of Canadian Money Sense Magazine and Forbes and Fortune and Globe and Mail all recommend that when it comes time to sell your home, all realtors are not created equal. You'll find that out in about 15 minutes when you sit down with a few of them. So take the advice of these publications and interview two, three, four realtors even for the job. Um, it won't take long. Uh, my presentation, my listing uh, presentation when I'm in competition takes 20 minutes. I'll come out, I'll give you what I call my informed seller's booklet. I'll show you some of the recent sales that I've done, some of the list price to the selling price, um, what kind of price records I've broken lately, which has been quite a few, and uh, let my numbers speak for themselves. Thanks for your time. Continue on with your interview process. Let me know if you want to hire me for the job. It takes 20 minutes. Good way to go if you're listing your property for sure, because again, all realtors aren't created equal, and uh, some realtors are more listing specialists like myself, and that's who you want to hire. You want to hire someone who has a marketing program in place and sells a lot of properties. Now, other times, so many times when I show up, they'll tell me, yeah, we're going to interview a few realtors and we're also going to uh, interview one of these low-cost brokerages, a discount brokerage. And uh, they say, well, you're going to charge uh, uh, you know, X amount of dollars to, to, uh, to sell our home. Um, the realtor we interviewed uh, two days ago says he can do it for $6,000 less than what you charge. So why wouldn't we go with realtor B here who is going to charge us less? And I always say the same thing. Well, the commission that you're going to pay it really is irrelevant. Uh, really what you want to be asking is how much money at the end of the day is going to go into your pocket. That's all that matters. doesn't make a lot of sense to save six or $7,000 on the commission if you're going to leave twenty or $25,000 on the table in your final selling price. And with me, I guarantee to my clients, I'm going to market the prop property fully, get the most exposure to it, and get you the maximum selling price. And I've got the numbers to prove it. I'll show you the new high water marks that I set in various complexes, uh, and that kind of speaks for itself. So uh, the bottom line is what you're going to net. That's the important thing. So uh, I'll go through what I'm going to do to market the property. I'm going to spend money. I'm going to advertise it, flyer it, real estate weekly, internet exposure. Uh, search optimization for it. Um, and a lot of times these discount uh, uh, brokers who are saving five or six thousand dollars ask what they're going to do to actually market and expose the property. In my experience uh, they're not going to do too much but you can be the judge for that but keep in mind the important question you want to ask is is what at the end of the day are you going to net and uh, that's all that really matters. It doesn't make a lot of sense to save a few dollars on the commission if you're going to sell the home at $15,000 less than what I could sell it for. I'm Owen Biglen. As always, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.